What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we are celebrating 500 subscribers. I know it's crazy, it's a big deal. Um, I'm super excited, I know it's not uh, it's not like a million or anything like that, but to me, th this, is, um, this is already kind of crazy. I just kind of put these videos out there for fun for the most part, and um, I just enjoy doing car stuff, so to to have 500 of you already kind of following my journey and and just you know leaving comments on the videos and liking and watching uh, that it means a lot to me so i'm i'm very very excited kind of on that note um i have some news that i'd like to share with you and i, I may hint at this some type of way like i don't know you can probably see that there's a white white car in the background right there you might be just thinking that's some other random car but um that's actually in my 4 Series and I'm not in my 4 Series and you might be wondering what kind of car is he in? I am super stoked to introduce the stick shift. We're back in the Beamer stick shift. We have M Sport. Do you know what kind of car we're in? You probably don't. I will show you. Here we have 2017 BMW 340i xDrive with the B58 engine. Guys, guys, it happened. We found one. We finally found one. The long lost, the long lost 3 Series manual is back. Is back. And here's the Here's the car that that started that, that kind of started this this whole thing. The car that started the YouTube channel. The car that we've modified a little bit, learned a lot about, learned how to upgrade. Yeah. But the new one is there, and it's here to stay. So this is a 340i. X drive with manual transmission. The amazing, amazing B58 engine in a beautiful historical blue. God, so awesome! This is so awesome, guys. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. This is great stuff, you guys. This is great stuff. I'm so, so, so excited. So, what happens now, you might ask? Um, well, we're not keeping both cars on the channel. Um, I wish we could, but that's not, that's not a possibility right about now. Uh, maybe, maybe eventually, but for now, uh, yeah new journey new journey baby new build new mods it's a similar chassis so i know it's not a huge upgrade or anything a lot of the stuff i'm very familiar with a lot of the stuff is still kind of the same but um it's still it's still a considerable upgrade it's a new engine i've been looking for a manual transmission for so long especially in this color and this spec um it, we have iDrive 6 on here um, heads up display all the LCI upgrades everything is everything is here everything's kind of cooler than in the in the old one I'm 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 so I'm so 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 excited <sighs> wow and it drives absolutely amazing it's it's so good it's, it's quicker than the it's quicker than the stock 435i I'm not sure if it's quicker than the um, then a stage two 435i i don't think so i think uh that one was still a little bit a little bit quick quicker and all of that but man i cannot wait to mod this thing i can't wait to personalize it to make it our own to kind of show you guys what we have in stock what we what we got planned this is going to be an awesome awesome journey you guys and um yeah i'm i just wanted to share that it's kind of a 500 subscriber uh celebration once we get to a thousand subscribers that's gonna be 
the next goal you guys and we're gonna do something special for that one we're gonna probably do a giveaway of some sorts nothing crazy I, I won't be able to give out a car or anything like that but we'll do something we'll give back to I want to give back to you guys to the community that have followed me on this journey all along so I just want to blabber anymore I just kind of wanted to give you a quick update kind of show you what we've got going on um, yeah this is great I think to start, I, I'm not a big fan of this particular, um, I'm not a big fan of these particular rims. Um, they're not bad, they're just uh, they're kind of basic. So I think what I'm gonna do is I will be putting these rims on my 4 Series and putting my niche wheels uh, from the 4 Series over here on the, on this one. We're gonna end up with these rims on this car. I think it's gonna look badass. It's gonna look so cool. Then we have some badging over here that we probably will get rid of um, sooner or later. Don't have a plate just yet, but we will be getting one <coughs> soon enough. I already see lots of carbon fiber accents on this car, probably mirrors, most likely, you know, the front lip, the little spoiler lip, you know, just kind of the classic package. We'll do all of that um, to this car. I'm so, so excited. Oh, look at those. Look at those LCI headlights, man. Gorgeous. Gorgeous car. Such a gorgeous car. I am a little sad. A little sad about the 4 Series leaving the channel. What a car that has been. It's been so great. What a journey. How blessed. Do I feel right now to have these two awesome, awesome cars right here? Wow. I'm going to pull them up in the garage and uh, probably transfer the rims and we'll, we'll see. We'll see what she looks like then. time she's so beautiful oh my goodness I definitely prefer the black wheels the stock wheels just were not my thing look at that man with the LCI lights looks so good and then if we go inside the car here we have black leather interior with this white type of stitching which it, which has a kind of an interesting look <clears throat> then we have this uh, gray brushed metal uh, interior with the gloss black accents we have these M M logos in a bunch of places like on the shifter but yeah, I, f I think maybe eventually, uh, at some point we're gonna wrap this maybe in some carbon fiber or maybe replace it entirely. But um, yeah, outside of that, things look pretty familiar in here. We do have the iDrive 6, which uh, I have enjoyed using. We have native CarPlay, which has also been pretty cool and it's wireless. So no more modded, no more aftermarket parts or, or finicky, things where you have to activate them and all this type of stuff uh, we finally have that OEM I will probably be coating 
uh, this car with Beamer code soon and you guys stay tuned for that I'll be making an upload of, of that process as well I'm kind of curious to see if there are any differences between the F36 and the F30 especially when it comes to the LCI and having the iDrive 6 which is the upgraded head unit so yeah you guys that, that's that's about it. I am still kind of getting used to everything um, in this car compared to the 4 Series. There, it feels like I have a lot more headroom, uh, which has been nice. It's been a nice change. I don't feel like kind of as crammed and in a, in a, in a box type of um, feeling. But yeah, I'm going to also kind of miss that uh, coupe and the coupe-like style and, and all of that stuff. But this should be a pretty comfortable car for... For road trips and stuff like that as well and also we're gonna be making it pretty fast so stay tuned for that anyway thank you so much you guys for the 500 subscribers thank you so much for watching for subscribing for liking the videos and uh, for sharing them I really really appreciate every every single one of you we're gonna go ahead and end this video here and uh, yeah I hope you guys stay tuned for this build it's gonna be so so cool I cannot wait to modify this car and make it our own. So please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.